Hello everybody and welcome to what's new in the iOS Arcade in the month of November. And we've got four fantastic games all launching on the same day of November the 7th. And this month's lineup is a mixture of original titles and titles that have been on the App Store before, but been given the Apple Arcade Plus, which basically means that you can play these games without buying them on the original store because they're included in the Apple Arcade subscription. So let's dive in and talk about what's new in Apple Arcade. And before we get into that, just a quick note, some of you might be familiar with this show because of course I've done this in the past just not on this channel but I'll explain more about that later but let's have a look at the first game in the iOS arcade so our first game this month is a TV classic that has been brought in an interactive way to play on your smartphone. This is a game where you'll spin the wheel, guess letters and solve word puzzles. And this has got a specific challenge based uh, leaderboard and daily challenges built into it. It's designed for casual players and dedicated players just to really get into some puzzling games on the go. This game is available on iPhone, iPad, Apple TV and the Mac, but for the first time ever, this one has been released on the Vision Pro 2. And this is something I didn't know was gonna happen, was Apple Arcade was gonna come to virtual reality. And what a step in the right direction for Apple that one is. So of course, if you're a fan of puzzle games and word games, then this one of this month will definitely be something that you want to download onto your device. And as I've said, it's mentioned on all the platforms, including the Vision Pro. This next game is absolutely chaos and it is Drive Ahead Carcade. It's a fast paced multiplayer car battle game, very similar to the brawlers that you used to get on Nintendo. The main goal is, is to knock your opponents out. And this game has great customization to allow you to customize your vehicle to how you want it to look out in the playing field. You can earn fame points from each each victory to upgrade and customize your vehicles and gives you something to come back and play. If you're a fan of Destruction Derby and Brawl'em Up games, this one is definitely going to be up your street. It offers you different battle scenarios. There's loads of cooperative and competitive modes where you can have your friends or challenge others in global tournaments. There's loads of stuff you can do, and if you enjoy your vehicles and your chaos, then this is definitely one that you should download onto your device. This is available on iPhone, iPad, Apple TV, and Mac, so that is the whole shabam. You can pick it up anywhere you like on what device you want to play on. And I will say that this game will probably be the best to play with a controller. The next title we're going to talk about today is the Texan Hold'em Poker, Pokerus Plus. And with this being a plus title, it does mean it's available without the Apple Arcade subscription, but you're more likely to pay and enjoy adverts in those applications. So this one, of course, is the plus title. And Texan Hold'em has been around for a very long time. I remember this being on Facebook in the early 2011. So it's good to see the title still knocking around. This, of course, is not a gambling game, even though it is poker. There is no money involved in this. It's essentially electronic currency that you will just use when playing the game. So use this as a tool to practice your poker without needing to spend a penny. And that's the big draw in here. There is no gambling aspects linked to it, which means you're not going to lose any money. There is a fair play guarantee, which means all the games are going to be enjoyable and not have any cheating. There's casino games included as well, which are different varieties of poker. And it's a great way to learn if it's something you've piqued your interest in the past but never had the opportunity to play poker, this is a great way. And then when you start learning how to play it properly, you can then enter the tournaments and special modes that they've included as well. And you can, of course, build a profile and show off your level, some of your biggest wins, achievements, properties and trophies that you earn by playing the game. And that is sort of your reward for doing well in poker. So instead of winning cash, you actually win electronic prizes, but of course it would be nice to win some cash on this, but with this not being a gambling game, then this is your alternative. Pick up the chips and lay down the cards and see how well you do playing poker. And the last title we're going to talk about coming to the Apple Arcade is Arachnoid vs Space Invaders. This is a plus title and what a great game to have on the Apple Arcade. This game has been on the App Store before and had loads of people download and enjoy it. It's got great reviews, so it's a good one to come over to the Apple Arcade, especially with it being the games from the retro arcade era. These are great to have in our pockets. These are what you'd have been playing in the early 90s to enjoy and pastime. So it's good to see that they're coming to Apple Arcade 
played as, you know, these are going to be some fan favourites. The gameplay mechanics combines the two of the Arachnoid series and the Space Invaders where you will bounce balls to destroy the aliens coming down. There's boss battles, power-ups, unique skills and over 150 levels to play through and there's going to be a ton of replayability here as it's, you know, a game that can be played in numerous ways with different strategies because we all play arcade games also differently so it's going to be good to have something that's so simple but enjoyable. Not only will this game knock you back a couple of years in nostalgia by playing these retro games, but it's also got customization that allows you to unlock new abilities and power-ups to help you tailor that strategy of gameplay with also increasing difficulties to really keep you coming back to try and beat that next level. So it's great to see this one come in. I know there's going to be a lot of Space Invader fans like what I was to enjoy this game. But yeah, that is everything that is going to be launching on the Apple Arcade this month. It's weird that they've done it all on one day and to be honest I've not been too much in the loop with this as I used to do these videos on a separate channel which I really wanted to birth but I realised that without having a lot of video game journalism it was quite difficult to do. But this is the one series where I talked about these games that I wanted to bring back because it was a video I really did enjoy. Seeing what they're going to launch and what you get for your value for money on the Apple Arcade is, is something I always wanted to bring. So I hope you've enjoyed this. Whether we keep this series going we'll see how well it does on my main channel which is the Car Lightning Snap This channel. And of course, let us know in the comments below if you want to see more of this content because we're going to trial it out. I think this is something that I miss doing and I want to bring it back because I do have a passion for gaming. I absolutely love it. Obviously, I'm more of a, a PlayStation Sony gamer, but I do enjoy a mobile game here and there. And that's why I want to bring this series back because as a big Apple fan, with this arcade i think there's a lot of stuff that we can talk about with the content and with the channel being around smart tech and iphones and apple and and everything to do with their sort of ecosystem i i feel like this video series has a home but let us know down below are you looking forward to any of the games what games do you think you know could be added to the apple arcade as if it's already on the app store there is a potential for it to come onto apple arcade you've got to think about the microtransactions and what makes the game fair because obviously that's how they port it over to this. I will leave a link to the original channel so you can check out some of the content I did back in 2022. The last video I did of this was October 2022 so to pick it up in a November yeah it's been two years but it's nice to just do this again see what Apple are doing and what they're adding to the arcade because I believe it's three years old now and you know I was worried it was going to die out but there are games coming in every single month from the managers, sports games, racing games. There's a lot on here and they don't remove the titles and that's what I really do love because every game they add adds a lot of value. So thank you so much for watching and we will catch you in another video.